Hello and welcome to this week's Oracle message for week of 7th of February. Can you believe it? I'm Ruth Ann Richards and each week I share with you an Oracle message that can help you stay connected to your intuition for the week ahead. And why do we do that? Because when we're deeply connected to our intuition, we feel more empowered and I would love more of us to feel that way. So this week I'm using an Oracle deck by Sandra Ann Taylor called the Quantum Oracle. And the message we have is friends and colleagues. So there's a bit of a party vibe going on here. There's a bit of a celebration about something. So if you've got something to celebrate, now is the time to do it. And we actually can do it, but please do things safely for you. But we can see here what looks like a group of colleagues having a party, they're having some drinks, they're having a celebration for something. So maybe you're celebrating something this week. And if you're the type of person who wouldn't normally get involved in those kind of celebrations or want to go to those kind of events, you're encouraged to do so this week for a number of reasons. First of all, you could bump into someone who could be helpful to your career or your next project and not helpful in kind of a way that, that sounds uh, negative, but in a way that sounds positive. So someone who understands your skills, your talents, what you do, someone who's willing to listen to your ideas and then say, that's a good idea. Why, why don't you go with that? Why don't we do that? So doing that this week is going to help you move your career up the ladder if that's what you want to do, or move you on to the next project that you find interesting and fulfilling, but someone willing to listen to your ideas. On a social level as well, you may be experiencing some celebration, a birthday, anniversary, etc. And again, it's important to participate in a way that feels safe and okay for you because we do need this social interaction. So this message this week is very much about connecting with other people. And if you don't feel you can do it in person like this, do it in a way that works for you. But connection is really important this week with friends and with colleagues. So if there's a difficulty that you've had with a colleague or someone you work with, this could be the week to very gently and very constructively resolve that. It could also be the week to look for a mentor. Um, I said earlier that, you know, you're likely to meet someone who's going to be helpful to your career or your next project. But equally, maybe you're looking for a mentor. So go in and see people behaving in a different way than just at their desk or just on a Zoom call. To see them interacting will give you an idea of what that person is like as well. And maybe one of your friends is celebrating or one of your friends needs your help to do that right now. Maybe they feel they've had a tough time, as most people have, in one way or another, and they want some help in celebrating. And maybe you don't feel like it, but actually your friend could do with your support at this point in time. And maybe you're the person who needs support. Maybe you need more of these people around you. Maybe over the past couple of years, you've got so isolated and insular that everything feels at arm's length. And this is a lovely message to say, dip your toe back into the water. We can see this is only a small gathering of people. You don't have to go anywhere big or do anything big, but just dip your toe into the water this week, looking for those connections around you that feel meaningful and feel positive for you and work on those. So I'm wishing you a wonderful week, everyone. Take care. Bye.